And welcome to another video from Hegarty Maths. It's Mr. Hegarty here, and in this video, we're going to talk more about our GCSE and A level um, calculator skills, um, skills that will help us in an exam situation. Today, we're going to talk about simple substitution. So, we would like to be able to use our, uh, our calculator to check a substitution. Okay? So, I'm just going to just do one example, but I'm going to show you how we can find f of 3 what the value of this function is when we put x is 3 in, what the value of this function is when we put x is 4 in, and what the value of this function when we put x is a half in, really quickly using the calculator. So here we go. First thing you do, get the calculator and uh, put it in computer mode. Now what we're going to do is we're going to copy this function. So I'm going to use a fraction, I'm going to type 7 plus, now I want to write 3x, so 7 plus 3, and you can press alpha x, that gives you an x, plus 2 alpha x squared. And now we've copied the top. Press the down arrow, and now we want to copy these brackets, 1 subtract 2 alpha x, and then close the brackets, and then 1 plus x all squared, 1 plus alpha x close brackets, squared. Now, just double check you've got the exact right function, you've copied it correctly, and we have. So all you have to do now with your calculator, look how good this is, press calculate, it asks you what x value you want, you want x is 3. You put 3 in, and you get negative 17 over 40. So just like that, f of 3 is going to be equal to negative 17 over 40. But the good thing is, another good thing is, you can just press calc again and give it a different x and press 4, it remembers the function and when we do that, f of 4 is negative 51 over 175 so f of 4 we said is negative 51 over 175 negative 51 over 175 and lastly we can even put fractions in we can say calculate a half rather than putting 0 0.5 let's put a half, let's keep it as a fraction Oh, actually, let's put 0.5. And the reason we can't put in 0.5, if you look, if we put in 0.5, the denominator here would actually equal 0, and we can't divide by 0. So instead of 0.5, let's change that. Let's instead work out f of 0.4. Okay? So we uh, go back on our calculator. We can press uh, back like that. And we press calculate 0.4 and we get 1065 over 49. So f of 0.4 is equal to 1065 over, and what do we say, 49. 49. And there we go. That is how you perform um, substitutions using your calculator really quickly. You can imagine the amount of substitutions you can do for this to check your answers in the exam, to check you haven't made mistakes. Thanks loads for watching.